Ash. What happened, Ash? I bought a car. Are you a little bit jealous? Investing is the most enjoyable thing I like to drive. One, go! Christian, you're in trouble, dude. Come here. Twist off? Oh, what's happened? Yo! Yo! What's going on, punks? Not so much. much, we're just chilling out in the new workshop. Where's your mum? She's, She's over, over in the other side. I'm loading up the trailer. Yeah. And you two are in here doing what? Um, searching up some research. Yeah, you're doing like some research. So check it. Something pretty exciting has just happened in the world of Patriot. Very exciting. Do we want to, Christian, do you want to tell everyone or should we let your brother keep Ashton. having the limelight? <laughs> what happened, Ash? I bought a car. Ashton finally brought a car and check out this thing. The baddest 45 that I've ever seen. Alright, so why a FJ45? Well, it's a classic, like, you, like, everyone loves them, no matter what you drive, no matter what you do, the FJ45 always puts a grin on everyone's face. Let's go on an adventure in the Toyota Land Cruiser, the world's toughest four-wheel drive. So there's a lot of kids out there that they pick up a lot of different habits from their parents, and I would, I've got to say, Number one, I think this habit has come from here, so. What do you found there, mate? I found a good car on Gumtree. He's been looking at this 45 now for a couple of weeks. He's been eyeing it off. We've just rung old, mate. It's pretty cool. This could be your son's first car. <laughs> it might happen today. What just happened? Um, someone just bought a car. You! You own a car, daddy. You own a car. You believe that? <laughs> Look at that. Ash bought an FJ. How cool is that? Come on, show your mum. This is so cool. What proud day. Proud, proud day. My boy's got it. What do you reckon, Rob? Oh, mate. We're going back in history, aren't we? That's pretty cool, huh? Oh, that is awesome. The 79 series was not going to happen. No. It was, very, it was never going to happen. Very expensive, yes. Christian, what are you thinking for a first car? Uh, 76, maybe. Mate, yeah. Maybe. Yeah, I don't think you can afford one of them either. I think we should run everybody through. Should we take them through and show them the 45? Absolutely. All right, let's go next door, see if we can find what Sarah's up to in Maya. And we're we'll going to check out this um, brand new ride. Yes, Ashton's absolutely. brand new whip. Let's go and have a look. Boom. Boom. <laughs> check it. The 45, and it looks right at home. Here she is, what are you doing? Packing. And you too, yes. what are you doing down the back there? Packing. Packing. <laughs> Not Where are we going, babe? Uh, we're going to Gordon Country, just out of Warwick, yeah? And do you know what's going on this weekend? Yes, I definitely okay. do. I'm riding shotgun with Ashton. Absolutely. So and Christian's riding shotgun with me. Yeah. In the black truck. The Land Cruiser yeah. from Australia, dude. This is so cool. Opening f***ing <laughs> SEMA. Are you kidding me or what? Here's the drum, here's what we're gonna do now, you and me. Yep. Let's go for a walk around while everybody's packing everything up. Let's have a quick walk around and show everyone around the 45. Yes. You're gonna to get to see a lot of it this weekend, but I don't know whether it's gonna come back in this condition. So whilst we got the opportunity, <laughs> dude, run us through your whip. Beginning like with the outside, it is all original paint. It's never had like bog or been welded up anything it looks amazing it's got this amazing bar work like made out of some pipe you know so real steam pipe bar work yep you ever seen that before Doug? not like this <laughs> <laughs> so good and the quintessential l plate you need one of these so it's a 1977 model so it's got the new doors they're a bit thicker they have actual handles like some main things like that you can really tell is the door handles and the doors are way thicker so they've actually got like the door handles and door cards which you like, can't get on the early model yeah, ones yeah different latches all that you know old school wind up and down windows old, old school another thing is the um windshield wipers are on the bottom oh, unlike, that's a good one. unlike the top on the 74 and later 
models. I never actually picked up on that, but yeah, that's true. The interior is amazing. Like the like normal Toyota little like floor that not most of them have, and it's got the good old four-speed manual. Yep, absolute beauty. Um, also another thing like with the newer model 45s is the D Froster on yep. the windshield. You got the pads up there, yeah. Yep. Which the other ones you don't have. No AC. No AC. We'll t I think we'll change that up there. Oh yeah. We'll have something that we can do. Every single thing works. Like literally everything. Like even like the parking brake light like works. Everything, absolutely everything on this truck works. And the best part about it is completely unmolested. There is not anything aftermarket that didn't come from the factory, except for two toggle switches in there that that have been fitted on this car. So the main reason, the number one reason you bought this one over any other one you've been looking for and you've been looking for a year is yep. what? This. The factory tub, the factory Toyota tub. But well, we're gonna whip that off and put a B Corp one on. Right? No. Denied. Everyone is expecting like that I would, but I'm, I like tubs, I don't know why, I just always have. It's had a big repair down in here at some stage. So you can see they've, um, they've spot welded all of this back into the tub inside in there. Usually when you see them, they're all rusted up in the top here. And this one is just not, it's a factory floor mat. Look at the floor in this thing. Like it is just immaculate and even behind the back. Actually, one thing that has been modded. It's got a long range tank under the sink. It's, yeah. Um, I, wonder, I wonder if that was done at the time of purchase from Factory Arts. Maybe, well, what I can say is the whole time that we have owned it, never put any petrol in it, which is probably a bad thing, but. What well, mode is in this? 2F in line six petrol. And there are 3.9 liter. <laughs> Yeah, we've done like some little, um, just maintenance bits. Um, so we've done the coil, a new negative, um, lead. We've done all of the tie rod ends, drag rod rebuild kit in there. So yep. it steers all good. So how good's that? Like proud as punch when your son goes and buys his first car and he buys a 77 Land Cruiser. But I don't think it started like, how long have you been looking for? Oh, like, I, I've been looking like, for a couple of different utes like here and there, but I got my heart set on a 45 probably about like four or so months ago. You know, you know when he got, got his heart set on a Land Cruiser though? Yeah. Remember that recovery up in Cape York? Yeah. Put the on. So this is going to be your first winch recovery, buddy. Yeah. All right. Well done, mate. Well done. Good job. Keep looking where you're going. Just go straight towards the tree. Watch where you go, man. Yes. Well done, brother. <laughs> That's your first recovery. Oh, your yeah. first winching session. Yep. There's going to be many of them to come. Well done, mate. All right, done. Walking around the 45. Everybody's going to get to see a lot of it this weekend. Yep, absolutely. How do you reckon you're going to go against the black truck? Well, it's all about the driver, to be honest. I'm going to give it like my best effort, like my best go, and that's really all that matters. I don't expect to win in this thing, but... Yeah. That's the words of defeat already. At, at least, like, she will get me there. Like, the reliability is top notch. Oh, we'll, we'll see what happens this weekend. Proud of you, homie. Well done. Now, for this weekend on the black truck, first time ever I'm running no canopy. So, I wanted to keep the center of gravity low. Now, there's a bit of a handover period going on right now between me and my boys, right? But for this weekend, I really want to show the boys who's boss. Now, you're going to say it's unfair competition. Oh, you're back again. Oh, yeah, it's very unfair. Like, you back. have gone, like, full sweaty. Oh, I have gone all out. I've had the whole Super Tour team for the past week going to town on the black truck, making sure everything's all good. Canopies are off. Um, we're going to see what Christian can do on the black truck this weekend, though. So yeah, it's that'll not, be interesting. It's not all about, mate. If he is driving, I've got a pretty good chance of winning because it's all about the driver. All right, let's get stuck in. Let's get loaded up and get the hell out of here tomorrow morning. Got a little surprise for him. So from the boys from JMA have just sent down the only thing that we're doing for it for this weekend that wasn't already on it. Da 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 da! I got you a present. Yay. JMA got you a present. 
Ooh. I think he's gonna need a hand with the Tesla. Nice. Dude. Nice. We can do that. Yeah? Yeah. Best part about this, no mounting to the dash, no holes in the dash. Everything's gonna sit underneath. Don't have to put a hole in the truck. Absolutely. Hand piece, gonna look original, gonna look factory. Let's get that in while we load the X-ray up. Ah, uh, good. I was online shopping. <laughs> What's it like rolling with this arm? It's really cool. Apart from, I need sunscreen. <laughs> no tinted windows. Have you got any idea how cool you two look through that rearview mirror when you're sitting there with your flanny on? Claire, what do you reckon? Pretty sick. They look pretty good, huh? <laughs> yeah. Now we're on the road, it's been a bit of a testing morning this morning. Christian, this is his first time driving the black truck on the road, eh? Yep. What's it like? It's very smooth and it's a very fun car to, to drive. It's got the power, right? Eh? Yes. And this is his first time towing as well, so he's got the new Patriot X3 on the back. How's your brother doing? <laughs> really well. He's doing good, eh? Yeah. Would you rather be in this or be up there in the 45 with those two? Probably in this one, it's a lot more comfortable. <laughs> it's awesome. Ashton almost just got taken out by a big truck. It's it, look with these kids on their learners, you've really, really got to watch everything that they do. No dozing off. Hey, no, no dozing off. No. Like I almost did yeah. before. Oh, look at the dog. Oh, you I need want to get one. a dog in the back. I need to get a dog. Wait, it's in your lane. That's why I'm thinking about dogs. So we're going to keep cruising. We're going up the gap right there. You can see Ashton right there in front of us. But now we're going to go up this steep incline. We're just sitting in the left-hand lane, making sure the kids are keeping everything nice and safe. Obviously, their first time towing, first time in his 45. We need to understand the reliability of it. We've got about an hour and a half to go, and we're going to turn off. Uh, we're going to start heading a little bit more west, and we're going to head into the four-wheel drive park. It's going to be a good day, I think. Almost here, almost at the home stretch. So, where we're heading this weekend, this is one of our locals. So this is a spot that's probably about two hours from Patriot HQ. If you haven't been to Gordon Country, it's one of the most picturesque local campsites of the Gold Coast, and we go there pretty often. Ash has been rocking pretty well, sitting on like 100 k's an hour, uh, pretty good. We just put fuel in it, 28 litres per 100 as it is. So I think the thing's running a little bit fat. Dave, you better get on that and adjust those mixtures. And another big surprise for everybody coming this weekend, you're gonna to get to meet the whole Monty Salvo family. And I'm talking 22 cousins, eight brothers and sisters. The old man's coming out, bringing out the X1. You're gonna see where this all kind of stemmed and started from. We're gonna get down this road now, get into Gordon country and put a brisket on. We're gonna get that done first and we're just gonna kick it today. Tomorrow, we're gonna to see what that 45 can do. Come over here, get near. Everyone, this is Sam. I hope you take care of everyone as well as you take care of Mate, me. always. The legend, look at our spot. <laughs> so the whole convoy's behind me. This is where we got for the weekend. It is going to be epic. It's, it's pretty big. Let's get them all in. Awesome. Everyone's all set up now. All good to go. You're all set up down there in your yeah, caravan, eh? It's, no? it's good. Just turn the hot water on, so I'll have a hot shower later. Like I said before, Bobby bought a Jayco. Why'd you buy a Jayco? Because I'm getting lazy and old. I've got grey hairs. Yeah, he's he is getting a bit grey. Babe, run us through what's in the brisket. One has a brown sugar rub. I've never done this before. And one has sriracha, Justin's favourite yeah. thing in the world. The smoker has been absolutely everywhere with yeah. us. Everything's starting to get a big bit buck wild. Peewees are out, bikes are out, whole family's here. This, this is how we go. Where'd you 
going f for a little cruise, I guess. Pro property, Dave. Exactly. Just watch the speed limits. Yep. You can take the camera with you. Yanni? Yeah, right. You're on. You film. <laughs> Would have seen on social this week, the boys from GSL, they're gonna lay down a challenge. They're gonna throw it up on Instagram now. I've decided we're gonna do three challenges. Who are you gonna nominate, Ash? All right, well, let's keep it real. D Danny Simpson, the baddest chick on Leafs, hands down. <laughs> the baddest chick on Leafs, you like that? <laughs> all right, Yanni, who are you gonna go with? Well, semi series all the way, Ronnie Dahl. Ronnie, it's gotta be Ronnie, eh? Always, yeah. yeah. All right, they're three of the baddest people in Land Cruiser industry right now and all people that we support. So I think they're all really good choices. Yeah. Lay it down, make sure the challenge is realistic. Don't let Christian whoop his ass too much. I need a fighting chance. All right, guys, well, we'll come back to you. <laughs> Brisket's on, it's two o'clock in the afternoon. Now, Sarah's been working on something. I'm gonna show you something down in here. Team Black Truck. The two trucks are right there behind me. Everybody is starting to pick their shirts, obviously. Team FJ45. Team FJ45. You picked the wrong shirt. Are you convinced me? It's, this is like Crips and Bloods up in here, Dave. Where's yours? You don't have a shirt? <laughs> I'm out. in the middle. Which team would you be on, Alexander? FJ. FJ? Yeah. <laughs> Dead to me, Yanni. <laughs> don't worry about it. We're going to go for a walk around camp and we're going to find out who are the real homeboys. Team FJ. Dead to me. But it's hard. Black Truck is the number one, always being the best. But then my son, my baby, first car. What is that shirt you're wearing? <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just... It's a big See, brother. Uncle Bobby? Of course I'm yeah. going to go with him. There's no doubt about it. Although, now that I know Christian's driving, I kind of feel bad picking a side, but you got to pick a side. Em, what are you rocking? 45. Dead to me. This is my sister, Christy. No one's ever met Christy before. Chris, why the black truck? Why not Ashton? I'm going original, the OG, black truck. Keeping it real, we're keeping, keeping it, real. it real. You've worked on both of them. <laughs> you spent all week working on the 45. I know. Unzip that hoodie, dude, I want to say it. All right, it's time. That's my dog. <laughs> Wait, Dave. Oh, no. This is, essentially, this isn't cheating, is it, Pat? No, no, I don't think No, it is. because there were no rules to say you can't be in high or low for. So we're going to do a little bit of a sneaky, but we're not going to tell anyone. This is it, the whole family's just uh, rolled up. Look at the lineup here. Look at the whole crew. This is getting real, yeah, boys. This is getting real. That was bad. So, I was trying to think of a challenge for so long that would favor the 45 because I'm all for old school, obviously. Look at my roof lining. <laughs> the reverse challenge. There's three cones. I'll put a little diagram here, excuse the drawing. But you're going to reverse around three cones. The last cone, you're gonna come back, right back to the start. Then you've got to pop your bonnet and check your oil. Once the bonnet closes, that is the end. Whoever closes their bonnet first after checking their oil is the winner. If you roll the, uh, the black truck and put it on its lid, you stay out here and you live here and forever you and you help Sam work <laughs> on the property and you never come back home ever again. Okay? That's it, let's get this done. Now the boys are over there setting up. I've got to say, look, the black truck's my baby. It's always been my baby. I think the FJ's got this hose. It's got a lower center of gravity. He's got all the windows around. The black truck, I'll be honest with you, it is a little bit top heavy and it's a little bit floaty as well. I reckon the 45 has got this one, but it's going to come down to the driver as well. You're going to see a big difference between these two kids here, eh? Christian is like, when we go out racing and he races the Razor, his whole thing is make it to the finish line. Ashton is exactly like his dad. He is balls and all. Doesn't care what he breaks. If he rolls it, if the thing catches on fire, I'm telling you now, you're going to see two completely different uh, driving styles. Whole families here. This is going to be gold. Let's get it done. Go second. Yeah, yeah we'll go. You go second? Perfect, Yanni. You're up. Let's do this. Fire her up, mate. Are they shaking hand big man? Do they all run across now, baby? Oh, good luck. Yeah, get everybody you. over here. You ready? Yep. You good? Yeah. Good you, luck. Just, you just be you. Yep. And win. Okay. Love you. Yeah? Love you, mate. Good luck. Give it a crack. Okay. Alright, give me the keys. Three, two, one, go! Yeah, boy. <laughs> 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> safe belt, safe belt. We're at 11, se 13 seconds. Go. Punch it. It's gone wide. 300 mil extended 79. Do they need this thing to reverse the F's? Yeah, boy! Keep it coming, keep it coming! Oil! 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 Quickly! 55. 50 gap, show us the bottom. Show us the bottom, get it back in. All the way in. Ready, stop! Show us the bottom. 103! I don't, I've got nothing to compare it to, but I reckon that was pretty good. Yeah. What do you reckon? You big nervous, big no, boy, huh? No, not at all. 103, Yanni, get in here. 103, Dave. Well done. I think he was a little bit wide down the back. Long wheelbase, 300 mil extended, 70. 79s don't turn at the best of times. Extension, that is going to be your advantage. Where you're going to pick up that time. So here it is, 103.13. I'm going to screenshot that. Let's get the 45 out. Here we go. Okay, here we go. Everyone ready? 103, he's got a beat. Three, two, one, go. Got you, dude. Ashton with a 56.05. Seven seconds quicker than the black truck. Oh, that hurts. Neither of my boys, neither of my boys like losing. They're exactly like their dad. On to the next challenge. Let's get this wound up. All right, so we've decided. The family's all headed back to camp. Everyone's going back there, get the smoker sorted. We're going to do challenge number two. Now, this one was laid down by Mr. Ronnie Dahl. It was pretty cool. It's called the Rubber Neck Challenge. Now what we have to do is drive through a campsite. You know what? Let's, let's let Ronnie tell the story. The Rubber Neck Challenge. It's the fairest thing I can come up with because anything technical, the black truck's gonna win. We just, uh, you know, you can't argue that. You are going to have to go to a campsite where there's a lot of people who appreciate four drives. One at a time, do a lap through the campsite. And the one with the most attention and rubber neckers wins the challenge. You're allowed to beep once. So, good luck guys, and I reckon this is pretty fair. So, may the best truck win. Here we go. So this is how we're gonna roll this. The black truck's gonna go first. Yep. We're allowed one beep. Yep. We've got a camera mounted to the left and the right side of each car, and a forward facing, so it's only what the cameras pick up. You and me, we're up first. Yep. Let's roll. All right, Christian, light the Christmas tray up. I want every single light on. Yes. Yeah, we got the advantage. Uh, roof lights, side lights, light bars, right side, left side. Yes. You're on high beams? Yes, I am. So we've got all the x-rays blaring? Yes. All right, let's try and count them out. Yeah. Black plant, ponytail club, dude. Yeah. You can blow some diesel. Okay. Put the clutch in, blow some diesel. There we go. Good, perfect. There we go, there's two. I can see two. Go, give it a ref. Quick, give it a ref. Yeah. Put the windows up. Keep going. All right, go That's straight right. down into the campsite. We're going to go straight down. Here we go. There's another one. Three, four. All right. Oh, there's, there's not a lot of people around, man. Keep rolling. So let's go. Keep it revving. So keep it in a low gear. Go left. There we go. There's another one. Keep going left. 
Yep, go back into first gear. Yes, there's another one. All right, quick, give it a rev. Keep going. Yep, we got more over there on that side. Yep, this goes all the way around. It looks like. Yep, keep going. Bing, 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 bing. <laughs> Morning. <laughs> they don't look very happy. I don't know if they can if they're not happy. Okay, let's go around. Right. Let's go around to the right. That's it. Keep it going. There we go. There's another two. I lost count. How many we got? Yep, we got a video. That's extended. Yeah. That's two points. Easy. That was worth it. There's, There's another two points over there. Go nah, we've got to keep going straight. Those were the rules. I think it was one lap was the rule. Alright. I think we did okay, but there wasn't like a crazy reaction. I thought that was going to be. Alright, lap side, brother. How many points do you get for a video? When someone starts videoing you, how many points do you get? I well, don't know how many views we got, but we definitely got a video, and I think a video definitely counts for something, does it not? Definitely. Uh, Alright, you yeah. guys, give it a crack. Fire her up. No, let's go. Seriously, don't embarrass me. No, you'll be fine. What's the point of this challenge? Wait. Ready? Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's Campsite, I wouldn't stop staring at it. That is the coolest looking truck here this weekend, hands down. That was the most embarrassing thing I've ever done. <laughs> that was so bad. I feel like you screwed up. That <laughs> everyone's when looking past at people, us, smiles, like, smiling for five and like, minutes, like, <laughs> and they're like, like they didn't like uh, it. I tried. I tried. Sure. I tried. Uh, Every, everyone we'll watch didn't the like footage it. back. Let's get back to camp, yeah? yeah? Right. Let's go check on that smoker. Yeah. Yes. Come on, let's roll. I think the day's almost a wrap. Yes. How did it go? It was really fun. You know what? We're not going to do a tour around the camp because the family's just doing what the family does and no one wants a camera stuck in their face. No. Jackie, say hi. Hi. Enzo's eating a big bag of chips. Say hi, everyone. We're going down to the creek to find the boys. What's your name, Seb? Oh, what's your name? How old are you? Four. Four? That many? Three? Yeah. Oh, that's pretty old. And what's your name? Sarah. How old are you, Sarah? We don't talk about Sorry, this is what I've been doing to all the kids. <laughs> this is just us. This is us doing what we do, what you've grown up doing. And Rob Dog's just turned up. He got here a little bit late. Thanks for watching, make sure to like and subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell so you get notifi notified every time we post. <laughs> this is me as episode All of right. Patreon Games. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> I think the camera's going back to the camera and I'm turning this thing off. <laughs>
versus the most iconic Land Cruiser, period. Make sure, guys, you throw some stories up and get into that good spot because that all adds to the photo. So get the photo up, get the voting poll up, and uh, let people decide. Get on it. Oh, you just push it back when you raise chair. chair. Get up here. Okay, we forgot to do something a couple of weeks ago. Yes. Remember when Ashton bought his FJ? Yes. And a photo challenge was thrown down by JSL? Yep. Guess what? We just remembered we never threw down the photo challenge <laughs> and the team's editing that episode right now. So what we need, everybody, we're going to throw the photos up. We need a poll. Which was the best photo, the one you liked the best? The black truck or the FJ? Go.